Welcome to this, the first in a little series looking at the 23rd Psalm. As we find ourselves increasingly physically isolated because of the restrictions that are in place right at the moment, it's more important than ever that we find ways to connect with one another. There's a lot of anxiety around at the moment, understandably. A lot of feelings of helplessness, a lot of people looking for security in what feels like such an insecure time. And into that anxiety and helplessness and insecurity, the 23rd Psalm has so much to say to us, so much to offer to us. And so this little series is entitled God's Strength for Anxious Times. And I'm hoping that as we spend just a few minutes each day reflecting on the Psalm, that we will meet with God and we will find his strength for the times in which we find ourselves. Let's pause for a moment and hear the words of the 23rd Psalm. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Do you know, our God is a God of abundant provision. The Lord is not worried that he's going to run out of anything at all. The God who we serve is beyond rich. He's overflowing with all good things. He has within himself everything we need and he is generous with everything that he provides for us. So this is a time to hear the psalmist's speak truth to our hearts as we discover the Lord is my shepherd. I have everything I need. So I'd like to invite you today just to take a moment, maybe grab a coffee, pause, be still, And take some time to recognise your own needs. Maybe there are things that you are feeling anxious about, that you are feeling helpless or insecure about. Just acknowledge these before God. And having done that, then turn to the 23rd Psalm. Read it through. And once you've read it through, pause. Read it through a second time, more slowly. And as you read it through this time, just reflect. Is there something in the psalm that is particularly speaking to you? Because that might be the place where God wants to remind you of his provision, of his grace, of his generosity to meet you at your point of need. Thank you for joining me today. I hope to see you again for the next video tomorrow. And in the meantime, may you know the truth of the fact that the Lord is your shepherd and that you have everything you need.